there. So this first proposition is set up in such a way as that the first part may or may not be dependent on the second part. That's the whole idea behind the two, where one thing leads to another. Yeah, right. In other words, I'm putting doubt into your minds as to whether, in fact, there is a dependency from one part of the proposition to another. That's important for when you define what you're going to do before you write your focus questions. Okay? So this one over here, if we accept that the collapse of Japan was imminent, so we're getting through to August of 1945, we all know that a bomb was dropped on Hiroshima. But this question is asking you, if they dropped a bomb on Hiroshima and 100,000 people were killed in that first bomb, and they know it's the most devastating weapon the world has ever seen, why did they drop the second bomb three or four days later? Why was there a need to? Why didn't they just drop a bomb on the coast of Japan? Saying, look, we've dropped one bomb on Hiroshima. We've got this powerful weapon that is just in one foul swoop taking 100,000 people. We could drop another bomb on you, and they did. They threatened to do that, and then the Japanese surrendered. So what this proposition is asking you to unpack is why was it necessary if Japan was already close to collapse, because the alternative was for another two or three years of war, because of the nature of the Japanese culture, that it's the ultimate shame, is to actually surrender. The one way to force them to surrender is to come up with a humongous weapon that whoo, takes out 100k people in one foul swoop. Here, Jeremy, question? Well, it's re researching historical evidence about it. Um, in this case here, we're asking you to look at the reasons why the second atomic bomb was dropped on Nagasaki. So yes, I guess there is a bit of opinion, but in a sense, that history is all contestable. All right? And we have to deal with what actually did happen in history. In this case, however, we're saying, well, what was the rationale behind them dropping that second bomb, really? And you're going to unpack it as you define that. Okay? Yes,